everybody, it's Bonnie from Bonnie's Pretty Pop at Reborn and Doll Nursery. How is everyone today? I hope you're feeling well. I hope you've been able to spend time with those that you love, accomplish a few things you set out to do, and I certainly hope you've had time to laugh and play and relax and just be yourself. Well, today is Friday, so I'm going to do a tag from Tammy over at My Reborn Nursery, and I'll tell you more about that in a minute. And I'm also going to do a name reveal. I have my brand newest little love right here that I just did a box opening for the other day. Um, this baby is just absolutely gorgeous. She is the Kinsley Sculp by Sandra F Sandy Faber. And uh, she is just beautiful. I also put in the description her artist, but I do want to do a shout out. She's beautiful. She did a perfect job. Her artist is Marguerite Costa, and she is from Maggie C's Reborn Nursery. And she just did a beautiful job. The rooting is amazing. Her hair, she has a perfect swirl in the back. And her hair, you basically can just kind of wipe down with your, with your hand. Uh, and then if you use a brush, I haven't even needed to put water or conditioner on it at all. It's just perfect. And she is, uh, for those of you who did not watch her box opening, she is a full vinyl reborn. She uh, has little girl parts, and uh, I thought she was going to be kind of heavy and um, not very cuddly, but she's very squishy. Look at this cute little belly button here. She's very squishy, um, and she is a delight to hold. Uh, there is a cloth body underneath her, so she is able to be weighted, and she's weighted perfectly for a newborn. Uh, I can tell her legs are weighted as well. Um, she's just gorgeous, and I just love holding her and spending time with her, and she's a delight. So without further ado, I'm going to give you her name. This is Maribel Sandy, and I'll explain why. Um, I think Sandy Faber did an amazing job on her, so I wanted to give her a shout out by the middle name. Mirabel actually means wondrous beauty, and she really is very realistic, very beautiful. So please, I'm introducing to you, our community, little Mirabel Sandy, and then of course my last name. Isn't she gorgeous? <coughs> oh, excuse me. Uh, isn't she gorgeous? All right, now to Tammy's uh, tag. Now that you've met Mirabel by her name, um, Tammy has done a tag, and I, I'm so grateful and excited about it. Her tag is every Friday. We are going to tell some of the things or all of the things that we're thankful for. Um, I think it's a wonderful idea. I think during the holiday season, we get busy with the details. You know, buy the turkey, cook the turkey. Then we go on to... Uh, Black Friday, buying presents. If you're like me, you've probably already started Christmas shopping, may even be finished. Uh, we have the, we always joke and say it is my, um, it's my family trait to have Christmas done sometime in October. I'm not done this year though, but I'm pretty, I've done like quite well. But I think we get so busy sometimes and caught up in the actions that we don't take the opportunity to tell those that we love and those around us what we're thankful for. So Tammy, thank you for this beautiful opportunity to say some of the things we're thankful for. So every Friday in November, we are going to do that as much as we can. Uh, the Pretty Poppets are gonna, pardon me, are going to participate. Um, first and foremost, I'm grateful for my husband. We've been married for over 41 years. He is a hard worker, a great provider. He's my companion, my best friend. We've been through so much together, and yet we have been loving and supporting. I'm not saying we didn't have hard times, because of course we did, but we were always able to manage to work our way out of it and figure out what was the best decision for our family. So I am mostly thankful for my husband, I'm thankful for my four 
handsome and sweet sons who are now adults. Uh, have Some of them have families of their own. I'm grateful for the men that they turned out to be. I was proud to be their mother and I enjoyed every moment of their childhood. So I am thankful for my four sons. I am thankful for my two daughter-in-laws for every sense of the word, they are my daughters. Uh, they came into our family with love and acceptance and I just love them. They're amazing women and I am proud of them. And um, I, I, I can't say enough. It's as if I birthed them myself. They're such wonderful people. And then of course I have four beautiful grandchildren. I have one grandson who is grown himself and I'm very proud of him. He's graduated from uh, college in New York and he's just an amazing person. And I have three granddaughters. One is in high school and the other two are quite young. I'm proud of every one of them. I love every one of them and they have definitely blessed my life. They are my treasures. I'm thankful for my extended family. My family that I was born into, my parents raised us so well and they did such a good job with all of us. There were eight of us, but we never felt like we were neglected or that they didn't have time for us. They were always there. Um, so I'm grateful for my parents that are both now in heaven. I'm grateful for my mother-in-law and father-in-law who gave me my most treasured husband. I'm grateful for my nieces and nephews and my great nieces and nephews and even a couple of great, great nieces and nephews. I love them all. They all touch my life in many ways. I'm grateful for my cousins. I have so many fond memories of them coming for holidays like Thanksgiving and Christmas and spending time with them and the memories that we built and we're still in contact to this day uh, via Facebook or whatever, we still uh, dote over each other's children and grandchildren and we just love each other very much. So I'm grateful for them. And I'm grateful for my Dolly community family. Um, you have become very special to me. I feel treasured to know you, uh, uh, blessed to know you. Um, you're all supportive and loving and I just I can't thank you enough for being in my life and becoming a member of my family. Each and every one of you have touched my life in a different way and I am appreciative for you and I'm grateful for you. And every day in my prayers, I thank for my family, however they came into my life, I'm grateful for them. Tammy, thank you so much for this lovely little tag so that we can stop and Remember the things that are important to us. And I'll be, I have so many things to be grateful for that in the next few weeks, you'll hear some more of what I'm grateful for. I love you guys. Thank you for joining me. I hope you enjoyed meeting little Maribel Sandy here. Um, I just love this baby. I, I'm very attached to her already. And I, I played with several names in Mirabel Wondrous Beauty is what it means and I just it just stuck so little Mirabelle and she's also so smiley and cute and lovable so I I hope that you enjoy seeing her you'll be seeing a lot more of her look at this little outfit that her artist sent it's so pretty uh, this is almost like a crushed floor uh, it's cream colored and then she has the little mint green with pink flowers around the ruffle the sleeves are gathered. She has a beautiful mint green with the same pattern bow. These little pink diaper covers are not thin. They're, they're kind of like a crushed velour too. And then these socks are adorable and I hope you can see them. Look at these adorable little fox shoes. They were in the box also. She's just lovely. And look at that little finger. Kind of reminds me of a Saskia a little bit where she's saying, I'm here. Look at me, I'm beautiful. If you're at work, please come home safely to those who love you. And if you're at home, I know you're busy, especially this time of year. 
I'm in the middle of taking down Halloween and putting up Christmas. We don't really decorate for Thanksgiving, although we do do the big dinner and the gathering and all that. So I'm, in, I'm busy. I'm sure you are too. Christmas shopping, all the things. But take some part of your day to put your feet up, to relax, and don't forget to eat chocolate. Mirabelle, mwah, and all the pretty poppets, and I send you not only love and kisses, but gratitude for spending time with us each and every day. We love you with all our hearts. God bless, and we will see you real soon. Have a wonderful weekend. If you want, you can drop comments. I think we'll either go to the flea market if it's nice enough, or we may go to thrift stores and do some thrifting. Either way, uh, we're going to have a wonderful weekend, and I hope you do too. Mm, God bless.